Hello, uh, you get a little sneak preview of something that's coming out tomorrow. I have a different tie on if you watch the show today because we pre taped something. Little secret, it happens sometimes. Actually, you gotta walk with me if we're gonna do this because I gotta, I gotta go really quickly. Uh, it was a good show this morning, 75th anniversary of D Day, Anthony Mason and Mark Phillips uh, in Normandy. Fantastic work. How many pieces did we do? A lot. More than five over the last two days with individual veterans telling their stories. Each one of them stood out as, as fantastic. Watch all of them. They will be below or to the side or over here. Uh, we gotta keep moving. Um, uh, really twisted story about a doctor prescribing fentanyl at such levels that 25 people have died. He's being charged with murder in 25 cases. That's a remarkable story. Um, we, um, we had a, a breaker uh, about a car crash with cadets at West Point. At least one person uh, has been killed. That's an update from the broadcast. That's a, a terrible story. Um, who was our guest today, Susan? I can't remember. Um, this guy named James Corden. Oh, James Have you Corden. heard of him? Yeah, no, I've heard of him. God, what was his name? Yes, uh, he's on yeah. the, late, the Late Late Show. Something like that. It's basically the, the forerunner. It's, it's our lead-in, basically, as, as he put it. He's going to host the Tonys. Uh, and he's gonna do a lot of musical dance numbers and everything. Uh, I will not be in them, as you can see. Um, and he had a wonderful talk at the table. Uh, although, if you, it? I think that's it. Yeah. Imaginary ball of paper. Imaginary ball of twine. The news is done. All right. All right. Bye, Johnny. Bye.